What is up? Turtle here, and today we have another Pokemon opening. We got another two of these trainer toolkits. Uh, if you've seen any of our videos for the past, I don't know, two months, uh, you probably hear me say that this is simply the best product, and I can't even think of a better product uh, ever for just the value that you get in there. Double the Dene, double boss's order, and a handful of other really useful trainers, alternate arts for a handful of cards. It just doesn't get any better. Um, so we're gonna open two of these. are actually gonna be for me, but for the code cards, uh, basically the stuff of the Dene's and the bosses, we're actually gonna be giving away uh, through some Twitch giveaways uh, during tonight's and Tuesday's live streams. Uh, so we do stream Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. And uh, yeah, next couple of nights we'll be giving away, we'll do um, basically the stuff from one toolkit in today's stream, and for tomorrow's stream we'll give away the, the Dene's and probably just the bosses. Um, if people are interested in the, the alternate arts, maybe we could do those as well. But it'll probably be, one giveaway will be for a Dene, and then the other one for the boss and the additional trainers. So if you do play the online game, I recommend you check, check out the stream. And we won't open these up. We took a look at the contents last time, but uh, yes, and uh, yeah, the box is pretty cool too. Comes with some pretty nice sleeves. All right, so this is probably gonna be pretty quick opening. We only have eight packs to get into, but like to be honest, this is all bonus at this point. So let's see what we can do. Unbroken bonds. Here we go. Uh, oh, I forgot about guardians also in here. That'd be an awesome pull. All right, here we go. So we do are taking like a, I'm not sure how how long this break will be, kind of like from Hidden Fates. Uh, next big set, Darkness of Blaze coming out in August. And until then, we kind of have some products here and there, but nothing too crazy. <clears throat> Definitely nothing to the caliber of this product. We got a Rhydon Reverse, and then a Persian. It's actually a pretty cool card with the Catterday attack. All right, here we go, another Unbroken Bonds. Hope everyone's having a good day and as always you do want to support the channel easiest way is simply like and subscribe to the channel and here we go another fairy energy so get it fairy charm ah, I haven't seen a lot of these cards in quite some time we got a Krabby and then just a sand slash all right, so, so far the pull rates haven't been too great on these toolkits, but uh, yeah, that's not really what this product is about. To be honest, I feel like anything you pull in the packs is just bonus from there. And so like this product, especially if you can find it for like 25 or less, I believe Game is, is sold out at this point. Uh, but if you, if you do want to purchase from them, just put your go to that page and put your email down. And if they do get restocked, they'll basically get email and um, then you can pick it up from there. But uh, Sword and Shield, uh, we're kind of whiffing here. I think the, actually probably the best hit we could probably pull at this time would be Dragapult from Rebel Clash. Definitely don't have a playset of those guys yet. V or V Max. All right, Vitality Band, pretty cool card. Haven't been pulling too many uh, useful uncommons in this opening yet either. A Baltoy is our reverse, and then a Syndrace. But yeah, there's also Quick Balls, things like Professor's Research, Marnie, and stuff, and as well. So these things are so so good. But yeah, check out the Twitch stream tonight. Giving away two Dedenes, two Boss, and then same thing for Tuesday. Alright, Scoop Up Net. Very useful card. Electrode, Stuffle, Coughing, a <clears throat> Shinx, Sandy Gas, Burning Scarf, and then just a Arcanine. Wow, we haven't gotten a single hit. It's a good thing we don't need to hit anything on these. And that's the thing from going from Hidden Fates to any other sets. It uh, can be a little bit of a rough transition back. <coughs> Another net. I feel like we're getting a lot of the same cards. Applin, Dana, Magikarp. A Tool Scrapper Reverse. That's pretty nice. I feel like, uh, is there already a secret rare version of this? 
And then a Galarian Weezing. I think this is the new thing to remove all abilities. Yes, as long as the active spot, you're... Uh, it does need to be in the active, though. All right, two packs remaining. I want to give a huge shout out to all everyone that supports the channel through Patreon. And uh, yeah, in case you didn't know, we do have a Patreon and one of the tiers does allow you to pick up products and we'll break it for you on the channel. And the Patreon, like the subscription will pay for the shipping and you know, you basically pick it up at the at cost for the channel. A Galarian Run Runerigus is our rare. Okay, we have not found anything yet. Here we go with the last pack. Actually, no, we always have these the Denny's to show for it. Hor We've been pulling a lot of horror energies from Rebel Clash lately. Alright, Cleave Fairy, a Voltorb, Growlithe, Dreepy, Snover. Ooh, reverse horror energy. That's actually pretty cool. If they come up with uh, secret rare varieties of these, I think they'll be very popular. And then a Vicavolt. So pack wise, not very good, but uh, this is the thing that this is all we really cared about. And then the bosses and other goodies inside. So that's gonna be it for today. Uh, reminder: Yep, we're gonna be doing some extra special Twitch giveaways uh, this week. So be sure to tune in. Basically, Twitch.com/slash or Twitch.tv/slash I Wanted Turtle. So hope to see you all then. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm Wanted Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. All right, so that video or that opening went by super quick and we didn't get any really good pulls. So I wasn't really satisfied with uh, while I was editing that. So let's just open up a hidden face tin. The good old reliable is like, you don't have, you don't have, have not pulled anything. Just open it, crack open one of these tins and you should be good to go. Let's just get this open real quick. Got ourselves a Raichu GX and four packs. Let's just jump right into it after we sleep up this bad boy. All right, four packs. Here we go. Mute two. See how you do. Reverse in the last slots. We got LT Surge, Magmar, Misty's Gym, Slowpoke, Pikachu, Charmander. Voltorb, Coughing, Kangaskhan, and then a Jigglypuff. And I mentioned last time, actually you can probably tell that the setup is different compared to, I don't know, like a week ago. Or actually just more than two days ago. And uh, yeah, I like it. It's just being able to record the uh, primary audio and like the face cam on my, the computer, I, same computer I do the editing actually makes a huge difference. All right, Magmar. A Staryu, Clef Fairy, Slowpoke, Brock's Training, then Blaine's Last Stand. Oh boy, is, is Hidden Fates gonna fail us for like the first time ever? Would be a bit of a letdown. Alright, so hopefully we can prevent that from happening. Metapod, Giovanni. Never find the, never pull bosses on so we get plenty of Giovanni's Exiles. A Golem is our rare. And then we got a Matang. Not one of the more sought, sought after shinies. And it's kind of off center, but we will take it. Actually, I feel like the lighting, the shadowing uh, is a little bit different in this one. I don't know, maybe the outline is a little thicker. I'm gonna have to compare this to some of my other card, other Matangs. Oh, just something about it looks a little different to me. All right, and our last pack. Hopefully we can get something a little bit better. All right, here we go. Charmeleon, Metapod, a Jinx, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Eevee, Caterpie, Paris, a Wigglytuff. All right, so we did it in our quota. Not a very, not a very shiny way to do so. Oh, Altaria GX, there we go. Let's see, centering, not great. I feel like it's a little thick on the top. Left to right feels pretty good. Um, but from the front, it looks pretty good. Like usually if it's kind of off center, top to bottom, like you barely see any kind of border. Uh, so maybe this one, it might be worth, eh, I do feel like it would get nine for centering. 
But either way, we did get a shiny GX, which uh, has been tough lately, so really happy with that. Alright, now with that, thanks for watching. I'm Wild Turtle. I'll catch you guys next time.